Hey friends, it's Shane and uh, Carrie from HowToWrench.com and we are super excited. We, uh, we meant to make a big formal announcement and we ended up just diving right into it. Things came together really, really super quick. Uh, tonight was first night ever in Southern California to offer classes here at the How to Wrench Shop. We're super excited to say that we've teamed up with Motorcycle Emissions with uh, Crystal over there and they are uh, doing a bike build with the Dofa Winery, the Veteran Sisters, Thunder Press. Did I forget anybody? Nope, that's it. We had a blast. Uh, they're restoring an old motorcycle, an old uh, CL350 that they're bringing back to life. And uh, fortunately, HowToWrench.com got chose to be the shop to do the engine portion of this uh, build. And uh, what a blast. I mean, uh, Carrie, I don't know about for you because uh, most people, you know, haven't seen Carrie except maybe in a, in a couple of videos recently, but uh, my girlfriend's never seen me work, never seen me, you know, do any of this, and uh, we had to pull some stuff together really quick. I mean, not only were, literally last night I was finishing up the airlines, I was still putting tools away uh, to try and make the space uh, work, and, uh, and I, I'm not going to lie, I mean, I haven't been able to stand in a classroom for a long time. And I didn't know how everything was going to fit, but uh, what do you think? I mean, you've never seen any of this craziness. It was craziness. awesome. It was awesome. I think they uh, loosened up pretty quick. Yeah. Yeah. We, uh, uh, what we did is it kind of just, you know, broke down, like, you know, what are your goals? What do you want to try and do? And kind of really turned the class over to them. Uh, nobody's going to be an expert in, you know, four or six weeks of uh, training or an opportunity. So it was really kind of a, a serious exposure to tools. Uh, mainly these people uh, are just interested in, the gals are interested in getting into motorcycling and thinking about maybe doing some uh, light maintenance or whatnot. And then uh, a few of them had bikes of their own. And you said a last minute student came from... San Diego. That blows my mind. That's like, I think, two and a half hours away. So really appreciative. Uh, the class seemed to be pretty dedicated. I mean, we went a little deep. I, I think I went a little nuts. We pulled out the cutaways and went into four-stroke theory and two-stroke theory, like I said, and I think it's really impactful. You've never heard of any of that before, and no. to be able to see that cutaway and then come back to the real motor. And, it made sense then. Yeah, I think they were, they were, uh, well, you know what? We're just going to have to have some of them get on here and say, you know, how they felt, what they thought about. Uh, really different for me, probably... It's definitely not the first time ever. When I used to have the chopper building school, I taught people that didn't want to do this for a living. But for the last 15 years, I've only taught people uh, in a formal classroom instruction, not the one-on-one -on -one stuff I do at How to Wrench, but in the classroom, I've only taught people that were looking to do this for a career or restore projects was really deep. So it's kind of hard to judge that audience and go, okay, how much is too deep? But I, I did, just kept going. I thought it was great. A lot of uh, great questions. They did. I mean, they blew me away. I, you know, those gals were asking questions. They weren't letting me get away with anything either. It was like, wait a second, what'd you say there? Is it left? Is it right? Uh, uh, really, really super fun. Stay tuned because we're going to share the story. We're going to share their journeys. Um, these are definitely veterans that served our country and uh, um, fought the PTSD. And they are doing this for therapy. What Crystal does at Motorcycle Missions is fantastic for how she helps those uh, survivors, I want to call them survivors, and veterans, you know, uh, really find some uh, passion and joy, and especially wrapped around two wheels. We love two wheels. Carrie got her first trip last weekend, so she's kind of getting <laughs> thrown in the hot uh, the hot seat here. But we, uh, we stay tuned. Like I said, we're going to have a lot more of them and their, uh, what they're doing. Uh, the bike is going to be unveiled next year, well, this year at Long Beach at the IMS show. So, uh, we, we can't believe, and just a few months ago, talking to Crystal at the IMS show, and now here we are uh, being part of it. I know they, they started the last couple weeks at the Dofa Winery and had nothing but good things to say. They're having an absolute blast there. They got the bike stripped down. I heard they even have the, power, the frame already powder-coated. Mm -hmm. They're really rocking and rolling. Next week, we are going to try to do some live... Uh, uh, tear down. Uh, one of the things that the, the group is really excited about is the vapor honing technology. We have the new vapor blaster. This is the new cat's meow. John, the owner of that company, is even going to be out here at some point. Uh, we just have so many good things going. We say please share our work, stay tuned. Uh, this is the first time I feel that How to Wrench has had an opportunity to serve and kind of give back. We've really been 
I know all our videos are free and all that, but there's nothing like standing in front of the group of people and shaking hands and doing your thing. It's uh, um, pretty humbling to, to be part of this. So, Crystal, thank you for everything, uh, you know, your support uh, over the years of, of plugging How to Wrench and what we do. And now we've got that, you know, opportunity to, to serve your veterans and uh, teach them some skill sets that they can use in their life. So, we are going to call the night. It's been a long day. Make it a great day, and as always, keep wrenching. Hey, what are you doing? Have you hit that subscribe button, that notification bell? You're going to be missing out on videos and free prizes and raffles we have coming up.